knows like you. He's on meds too. Call 800-333-1750. 800-333-1750. Do you have three ex-wives and your current trophy wife wants a life insurance policy three times the size of the policies you had to purchase for your previous mistakes? If so, you need to call Big Lou at Term Provider. 800-333-1750. Big Lou is intimately familiar with your problems, and if you're 50 or 60 years old and in reasonably good health, a $1 million policy should only cost about $100 to $200 per month. Big Lou may have a solution for your previous policies as well. You may even save enough money to lighten the load on your new $1 million policy. Remember, call Big Lou. He's like you, except he's only on number two. Call Term Provider at 800-333-1750. That's 800-333-1750. For a million dollars in term life insurance that you can live with, call Big Lou at 800-333-1750. 800-333-1750. iHeartRadio is the easy-to-use app for music and radio, which means you can take us with you wherever you go. But there's so much more than radio. Tell us an artist you love, and iHeartRadio creates a custom station just for you with their biggest hits and similar artists it's that easy as you listen thumbs up or thumbs down songs and we personalize the station to suit your taste so right there on your phone it's your own iheart radio station iheart radio it's more than just radio it's all your music too download the free iheart radio app now boston's bulldozer talks to you noon to three dave ramsey talks to you seven to ten and the voice of boston talks to you 24 7 wrko this is Alex from East Bridgewater, Mass. This is Ian in Sacramento. This is John Zuko from Hanson, Mass. And this is the Holly Car Show. So, Senator Elizabeth Warren, the pride of Massachusetts, goes down to Washington, D.C. today to address a Congress of Native American political leaders. Rather than apologize, she doubles down on the fraudulent claims, the fraudulent ethnic claims that have laid the foundation of her career. And this is just, I mean, the story of the speech is just sick. I know, I, I hope at some point we can get audio of this, but I think but because if they just re- released the transcripts of the Globe, I doubt that uh, there was anyone there recording. But, uh, so she's, she's, gonna, she's made a promise. She's made a promise to the Native Americans how she's going to deal with her lives. So I'm here today to make a promise, she says. Every time someone brings up my family's story, I'm going to use it to lift up the story of your families and your communities. Well, that's awfully nice of you, Senator Warren, by Awata. So anytime someone brings up your lies, you're going to pivot and talk about actual Native Americans who you've lied about being one. Okay. Tell me about Pocahontas. It's Pocahontas, Elizabeth Warren. Her saying, every time someone brings up my story, I'm going to use it to lift up the story of your families and your communities. That's like uh, OJ saying, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to use, if someone attacks me for probably being a murderer, I'm going to use that story to uh, tell the story of other victims of murder. That's <laughs> so outrageous. Yeah, the other victims are like, mm, maybe you're not our best spokesperson. <laughs> exactly. Uh, today's a great day to get on the jump line, by the way. You can do so by calling 844-542-42. Press 2 for the jump line. I'd like to hear some good reactions to Hiawatha's speech today down in Washington, D.C. to a, a gathered assembly of Native Americans. Uh, and just to update you on that breaking news story, uh, there are there's a reports of a school shooting in Florida. The shooter is still at large. Uh, right now, Fox is reporting that there are more than 20 victims, uh, 20 injuries. Uh, we'll, uh, you know, obviously the, in these kind of situations, there's a, uh, a lot of uh, fear and uncertainty that goes out on, you know, social media and everything. So we'll uh, we'll wait a little while on this one. But when we know things for sure, we'll uh, we'll keep you abreast of those details. Uh, and if you want to be a part of the program, again, 844-500-4242. Uh, Frank, you're next on this one with Steve Robinson filling in for Howie Carr. Go ahead, Frank. Hey, how are you, Steve? Hey. Um, well, I, uh, my family's been around... Massachusetts since the 1630s. 
and I had the same story she had. Oh, they were American and she back on both sides of the family. So I took the test and I have a zero American Indian blood. Now the other thing is, all you have to do is take the test. She obviously, if she had any American Indian blood, she would have taken the test and she would have, and she'd know her blood quantity. Oh, come on, Frank, don't you think she's already, don't you think she's already taken that test? Obviously, oh, she has, I guarantee she, she, has, she has 100% taking that test, and it came back with the same results that your test came back, and that's why we'll never see any public results. You know, that, that, that's the case. She could, she could, it would be the biggest own. Don't you think she'd want to embarrass Howie Carr by taking that test and throwing it in his face and saying, there, I am Native American. Stop bugging me. I'm now running for president. I, I, thanks for the call, Frank. Appreciate it. But she has 100% taking that test. It would, yeah. be like, it would be like 80 bucks to make a big political headache go away. And she really hates Howie. Oh, of course she is. She hates brings Howie. him up at like the St. Patrick's Day breakfast. She brings him up all the time. Well, she would love to shut him down. Howie is living in her head rent free. And, and you know, she she's taken the DNA test and she didn't like the results. And now we get stuff like this. We get her going into uh, in front of the American Indians and saying, for generations, Congress after Congress, President after President, the government robbed you of your land, suppressed your languages, put your children in boarding schools, and gave your babies away for adoption. Well, yeah, Senator Warren, that might be true, but why are you just speaking about it now? Why just now? You've been in the Senate for a long time. We'll be back with great news. This is Steve Robinson in for Howie. This is the Maui Car Show. Suffering from the winter blues? Maybe it's time to stock up with liquor and more. Don't go out in the snow and avoid long grocery lines by taking advantage of their delivery service. Liquor and More has a great selection of wines, beer, and liquors. If you are the hardy New England type, you can visit them in Plymouth, Bourne, South Dennis, or South Yarmouth. Go to their site at liquorandmore.com to see the variety. Liquor and More has just what you need. Liquor and More, a proud sponsor of life's memorable moments. Are you looking for a pre-owned car? Well, before you go to the dealership, where you'll be popped on by pushy salespeople, give the car guys a try. I'm Bill Papa George, and my job is to make finding the perfect used car as easy as possible. That means I do all of the tough legwork for you. Once I figure out what you want out of a car, I go find it. I've been in this business for a while. I know what to look out for. I won't bring you a car unless I know it will meet or exceed your expectations. So give me a call at 800-300-4600. That is 800-300-4600. RKO, the voice of Boston. Cool shooting in Florida. Good afternoon, I'm Evan Eidenrich, WRKO News. Miami TV station WSBN is reporting at least 20 people are injured after the shooting. Law enforcement personnel from several agencies are reportedly looking for the shooter inside the school. It happened at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida, about 45 miles north of Miami. Let's check traffic now with Mike Chang. Well, not easy getting out of town. The expressway southbound is crawling along from the O'Neill Tunnel all the way down into East Milton. North to the north, 128 north. It's slow through that Lexington stretch. That's about it. 94 north down to slow in spots. Route 16 up to 128. Really jammed up from Concord Street up towards 495 as well. And 95 north is backed up over a mile through Botsford with a crash up after Tupsfield Road. Get traffic and weather whenever on WRKO.com. Warm temperatures continue. Mike Ellis now with the WRKO forecast. Skies will be partly to mostly cloudy for tonight. There could be a rain shower after midnight, a low near 36. Tomorrow, considerable cloudiness. A highs between 55 and 60. Tomorrow night, rain lows near 47. And Friday, some morning rain showers, mostly cloudy in the afternoon afternoon and windy, a high near 51. It's 45 degrees in Boston. This report a service of Rocket Mortgage by Quicken Loans. Rocket Mortgage is simple, so you can understand the details and be sure you're getting the right mortgage. Apply simply, understand fully, mortgage confidently. Visit rocketmortgage.com today. License in all 50 states, equal housing lender, and MLS number 3030. I'm Evan Eidner, WRQO News. Wednesday was an awfully informative day, BB. What do you think could come our way on Thursday? Yeah, I gave you the 411 on Chester Arthur today. Is it Tippecano and Tyler 2 tomorrow? Is it Rutherford v. Hayes? Believe me, we got something cooking. I can hardly wait. It gets started tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. Kim and BB, weekday morning, 6 to 10, on the voice of Boston, WRKO.
Hi, this is Barry Armstrong. Last November, my firm gave away a guide that outlined the seven signs of an impending market correction. Those signs included rising interest rates and overvalued equities. And as we've seen over the last week, those two issues have had a major effect on Wall Street's recent performance. Is the worst over? Well, time will tell. But there's a lot of people who are uneasy about what they're seeing in the markets. If you're one of Let's sit down and review your investment strategy. If you're working with another advisor, that's fine. Come in, get a second opinion. It'll cost you nothing, and you might learn something about your portfolio. I've been helping my listeners with their financial planning needs for years, and I'd like to help you too. Call today and set up your free consultation at 800-393-4001. That's 800-393-4001. Securities offered through Securities American Incorporated. Member FINRA SIPC and advisory services offered through Securities American Advisor. Incorporated Barry Armstrong representative Strong advisory group and the Securities American companies are unaffiliated. As you get ready to make a healthy lifestyle change this year, New England Fat Loss hopes their thousands of success stories give you some added inspiration. My doctor told me I was walking the edge of a cliff with my life. Hi, I'm Greg, and after trying everything, including gastric bypass surgery, I was desperate. I heard about New England Fat Loss and finally went in. Due to their metabolic technology, I'm down 102 pounds with about 40 to go. The lifestyle choices they've taught me have literally changed my life. I'm no longer pre-diabetic, and the compliments just keep coming. And my wife loves the new me. Thank you, New England Fat Loss. If you're ready to change up your lifestyle, set up your consult today at NewEnglandFatLoss.com. Make this the most healthy year you've ever enjoyed. NewEnglandFatLoss.com. New WRKO, the voice of Boston. Celebrating 25 years on the air, this is the Howie Car Show. Welcome back to the Howie Car Show, everybody. This is Steve Robinson filling in for Howie. And uh, just an update on our, our breaking news story here about the school shooting in Broward County, Florida, at a high school down there. The Daily Mail is now reporting uh, that there may be as many uh, as 50 injuries in that shooting. So uh, just terrible, horrifying, breaking story here. But uh, we'll try to keep you up to date as, uh, as we learn more. The shooter is still at large. And uh, we don't know much else there, but it, we'll, uh, we'll let you know as soon as we know it. And we're going to continue on with uh, Grace's News. Yes, thank you. I first want to send my condolences to the Hines family. Jack Hines, who is known as the Dean of Boston TV News. He was with Channel 5 for a long time. A real legend in the business, though he, he really shied away from the celebrity status. Um, he was a legend, and his son, John Hines, is a great friend of my dad's and a prominent Boston developer who we've actually had on the show. So we just want to send our well wishes to the whole family. He was a he was very well known in Boston and he will be missed. And moving on to some crazy sounds. I have a lot of sound today. I want to start with Cut Seven. Chris Cuomo was interviewing Jim Jordan. And um, we love Jim Jordan. He's, he's a good he's a good firebrand, good conservative out of Ohio. You know what's fascinating, Steve? If you watch these clips on YouTube, in my mind I'm like, oh, they'll title this Jim Jordan shuts down Chris Cuomo. But people are so warped that they actually title these Watch Chris Cuomo totally shut down Jim Jordan. And I think 